it was um, slow. <laughs> oh, there was so much time to do everything, to think about things, and and to plan uh, all the superficial things. For your character? For or the movie for itself, the movie in itself. general, yes. I saw the movie recently, just a few nights ago, and it was the first time I'd really seen it. Uh, I saw the movie after we'd done it all those years ago, and I was terribly disappointed because I'd been so impressed with the, with the script. Uh, I sort of shot it in my mind's eye, and I saw the scenes. Uh, and then when I actually saw the, the movie, and I'd gone through a period of you know throwing that out. I, um, I didn't think of myself as the director. Uh, I was very subjective as, as the actor. But I was so stunned, so surprised when I saw the finished movie. It was so different from what I had imagined it was going to be. Mm. And it really threw me, and I was terribly disappointed. So when I saw it the other night, it was really the first time I'd seen it, that I was very touched by Paul and by the character that I was all, all those many years ago. And uh, it was... Um, my character, you asked me what I was playing. I didn't really know what I was playing. I think it was, a lot of it was instinct. Um, she was very complex, and I had a very complex life at that time. And I was, somebody asked me if I had written the backstory for the characters. Some actors do. I didn't do that. She. She, uh, I was using myself a lot. Um, she was very complicated, and she was shy, and she was brazen, and she was so many different things. Was Paul Newman a, uh, a co-star that was a fun experience? Yes, we, we had known each other briefly from working in another movie, Until They Sail, where we had a scene together, but we were never uh, closer than 10 feet from each other. And, and I didn't have any direct dialogue with him. Um, and I really didn't get to know him un until uh, The Hustler. Uh, it was extraordinary getting over those few weeks of getting used to seeing that face in front of me <laughs> was very, it was so beautiful <clears throat> and quite distracting for a few weeks. And then I began to uh, adjust and see him as the person and as the character. And you ended up with your first Oscar nomination. Uh, yes. For The Hustler. Yes. Which was uh, a wonderful experience or no? I really didn't care. I didn't care. Um, I just thought it was, I just didn't believe in awards for performances or judging performances. Um, you know, this is better than that. You know, I stayed in New York having dinner with my mother-in-law and my husband sitting at a, a little coffee table in front of the set. And I do remember being so grateful that I wasn't there at the ceremony. And, and then when they announced my name as a nominee, I remember feeling my face get very hot, and I knew it was getting red, uh, just like it used to in school when my name was said out loud in front of the class. Oh, God, <laughs> I'm so glad I wasn't there. Did you give any thought whatsoever to the thought of the possibility of winning? I didn't think I would. I, I just didn't think of what happened. And, um, uh, Sonia Lauren was nominated in Two Women, with an extraordinary performance and movie. Um, there was just no way that I would win. I really didn't care. I just didn't want any part of it, except I couldn't resist watching the ceremony.